Hi, this is Zed Dukla with your Ink Tip of the Week. We're going to be looking at Google Docs and some of the new features here, and yet another version of keeping up with Google. Last time we looked at Google Slides in the three new features there, so let's look at Google Docs. A uh, reminder of something that they added last year. This is called an activity dashboard. So when you click up there, you're going to see who's chimed in on it. Now, I'm the owner and the only person that's been on this doc, so there's not much to see there. Okay, but let's go to a document that has the yearbook staff up and running on it. So I want to see who's chimed in, who's been there. This gives me a quick, quick look just of the activity that's happened on that particular document. OK, yes, I could go into the version history, but that's just a real quick look. And that's activity dashboard. Another one. This is actually live on both docs and slides. Now, I love what they've done. When you hyperlink something, it used to be just a line underneath or above. So here's what they've done. They put a preview in. So this is a YouTube clip and you can see underneath it shows me the preview before I actually click on it and say, yeah, that's where I want to go. This right here takes me to a blogger. So again, a quick little preview. And this actually takes me to Twitter. So a nice little thing, just the preview for the hyperlinks. Next, they've always had this tool for word count, but now they've added this feature underneath where you could go ahead and click it and keep the display on all the time. So it's taking a look right now and giving me the word count. I don't typically use that. Maybe students might. So that might be something we could show them. Click. And I want to get rid of it. So I just uncheck it. And then we're back up and running. The last one I want to take a look at, it's important for some people, it's custom line spacing. So you come up to line spacing. Now they've always had these options right here. But now you have custom spacing. So you can come in, you can change and personalize whatever you want, and then apply it. And you have your custom spacing. Hopefully this has been helpful. Have yourself a great day.